Hey, um, just want to shoot a real quick video because I got some prints in uh, for a client who's decorating um, her home. And finally, these uh, canvas, what I call the canvas gallery wrap prints are starting to catch on. And I keep saying this is that you have to actually see these in person to really appreciate uh, the product. Um, and I have a number of them hanging in my home, so when people come in here for appointments and whatnot and they see them, they're like, wow, you know, that looks really neat. To show it at these products as a, as a still image on a website just doesn't cut it, so I'm trying to do maybe the next best thing is doing a little video. I've done it before, but I'm going to do it again because what she's ordered is a special crop of a dogwood image that I did. And um, because the lab that I use is, is, is one of the best photo labs in the country, I think. And they're out of St. Louis, and they do a great job for me. They know my work. Uh, they're so familiar with the files that I send them. And um, if something is wrong or something doesn't look right, they get on the phone with me right away. And, and it's just, they're just the best. Um, I also sell these gallery wraps through my online storefront. Um, for retail as far as the people who just want to buy like one or two um, but this is a bigger order so for the bigger orders the more custom work I use my my professional lab that I use also for my um, commercial art reps that buy uh, in large quantities from me so um, first of all they ship wonderful because it's all been carefully uh, packaged and um, wrapped in and cardboard and I already cut the tape on a lot of this but it was just they, they always do a great job of packaging I've never had a problem with the damaged print um, this one is really a unique size and I just wanted to show everybody this because it can give you a good idea of you know the gallery wrap prints uh, that I provide they um, don't have to be such the usual traditional size formats this is a 16 by 40 so this is a great because it's going into clients, um, it's going into a, a bathroom where there's a narrow, relatively narrow wall space. So um, really this image of this dogwood, it was taken out in Hocking Hills, of course, <laughs> was, um, there's much more to the image. But when she saw this, we worked with it doing a special crop to fit in a very, very narrow space while I still being able to do a gallery wrap. The problem is, when, well, let me explain, the gallery wrap, is you know first of all it's all printed on a really uh, high grade canvas coated it's our archival quality it's wrapped okay around an internal frame okay so which is really really nice because they come ready to go up on the wall um, traditional framing is is great especially if you've got a place as they're going like in you know, a lot of the medical offices and hospitals that I sell to where the prints need to be protected uh, you have to go with traditional framing. This is a, is a great option if it's going in your home or in an office that doesn't have a lot of traffic. It's a secure environment. It doesn't have, you know, it's not, it has a risk of people grabbing and taking it and touching it and taking off with it. So um, the canvas goes around the internal frame. Um, it comes wired already to be hung. And um, this image, particular image, like I said, it measures 16 by 40, so it's going to fit very nicely in a, kind of a, a narrow wall space. Uh, but what we did was we cropped the image to highlight just the one bloom of the dogwood flower. And then it had all these nice uh, branches and a lot of nice uh, narrow depth of field with a soft focus in the background. It's a very pleasing image as far as uh, soft colors go. Um, but there's all these branches, the lines. The problem is, is doing a wrap around and with this particular image just didn't work where it, part of the image would actually wrap around so the next best option is going with a solid color right through here for the wrap around part and if it's just going in a, a, a wall space where you're just coming in you're not you know have a lot of room to really look at it that'll work it's fine and it's a neutral black so it'll work really nice the problem why i couldn't get it to wrap around is because all these branches, these lines, trying to build out the canvas or the, um, the image so it effectively wrap uh, while at the same time maintaining the placement 
of this primary subject here, it just wouldn't work. So that's why we had to go with the solid color for the wraparound. But I wanted to show everybody what it, what it, you know, how impressive it looks. These are very nice for a home. Uh, like I said, they go in ready to be hung. You, they're a little bit more pricier than a, than a normal print. But keep, this is the big advantage. It's ready to go up on the wall. No framing, no matting, no glass, no mounting, and no all of that. It may, can be extremely expensive for a print this size. So that's why I keep pushing these as a great option. They're very impressive to look at too. They're very lightweight and easy to handle. But when they go up on the wall, it actually they look like it comes off the wall, and it actually is a little bit more three dimensional than a traditional print. And um, they just, I just. When I, this came in, I just had felt like I had to do this video to show everybody this. I'm going to drop it off to that client today. Um, let me show you another one, more of a traditional size that I have hanging here in my home. This is a 30 by 40, and um, see, it's still very lightweight, all ready to go on the wall. Very good construction, and like I said, when they come to me. Uh, from the lab in St. Louis, they're always packaged very, very well. Never had any problems with any damage to these. And this is already about two years old. Um, the thing to keep in mind is you don't want to hang these where there's direct sunlight hitting them because that's going to, even though they're archival quality, that it's sunlight will, it's going to break down ink much quicker than any other kind of light. So no direct sunlight, but it's really a, a, a perfect, um, affordable, and impressive option for decorating a home. Um, I'm also working on, I'm playing around with Photoshop CS5 and what's called this uh, content aware function for eliminating um, objects. And I know this is far away, but uh, I'm going to put this on my blog too to show you, you know, what I think of this con new content aware feature in Photoshop CS5 and show you a couple of samples I've been playing around with and uh, as far as just like removing objects like that. So this one show everybody real quick that canvas gallery wrap print and uh, it's the yeah, take uh, uh, think about that um, especially um, if you've got walls that are kind of a neutral color uh, whites you know your lighter colors or, yeah even darker colors depending you, know, you have to choose the right kind of image um, it really is a, a smart way to go. So just want to mention that real quick and thanks a lot.